Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm really excited for today's video. It's going to be the first of its kind on my channel. It is a beauty haul video. So for the month of April, I just want to recap all of the products that I have sort of put money into a little excessively. Um, but hey, you know what? Sephora had 15% off that month, so I had to take advantage of the VIP sale. Um, so I did that. So I'm going to show you guys what I purchased there. I also received my Tribe Beauty Box for the month of April. And I purchased some products, some Morphe products. And yeah, and some products from the dollar store that you'll be able to see. And what else? Uh, Walmart. So stay tuned. The first thing. The Tribe Beauty Box. Super excited about this uh, Marc Jacobs setting mist. It's their coconut setting mist. I haven't tried this yet, so I'm really, really excited about this one. Um, it combines 24 hour performance with hydrating, skin, lo skin loving actives. It's a fine micro mist and it delivers a healthy looking dewy glow. I'm usually dry in the winter, but in the summer I do have um, my T-zone is oily to combination, but I'm still really excited to try this. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna definitely be trying that one. There were a few face masks in this kit. There was four. I actually used one. It was really, really good. I forget what it was called though. I think it was it restored, regenerated, and repaired or something like that. But these are masquerades. There's three of them. I'm excited to try this um, Too Faced Tinted Moisture Drenched Lip Treatment. The shade is super pretty, but I don't even know if I swatch it for you guys, if that's even going to work. Hopefully that worked. I kind of messed up my lip balm. But I'm excited for that. So this is a subscription makeup box, the Tri Beauty Box. Um, I just signed up for the month of April, and basically all these really um, full-size goodies come in this beauty box. So I'm really excited for the next few ones to come. I believe it's about $50 in total Canadian or something. This is the Ruby May Cosmetics Dual Brow Brush. brush. Haven't even touched it yet, but I'm going to be using that and also came with, this is so pretty, oh my gosh, this Ruby May Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. I've been loving shimmery um, eyeshadows lately and you guys are going to see my Morphe sets. Oh my goodness. And I got them for such a steal. So the Ruby May. All right, that's it for the beauty box. I'm gonna show you guys the uh, Morphe palette. I've used it already because I just couldn't resist. But hopefully, you guys can see that. This is the Copper Spice 25A palette. It's like eyeshadow <sighs> <My> goals. <laughs> I have another one for you guys. I just wanna this guy awake. I'm like a little bit of a neat freak. Alright. You guys are gonna love this one. I believe this palette is the 350M, but I don't know what it's called. This oh yeah, this is the matte palette, that's why. It's the M. So can you guys just take a look at these nude to brown? to bronze tones. I really hope it's showing for you guys. Like, these are eyeshadow dreams and goals and everything that I need in an eyeshadow palette right here in one, well in two, because I do like the shimmery colors in the other palette. So I'm super excited. I've always wanted to try this brand. And guys, I'm gonna link down below exactly where I found these. 
for $30 Canadian. Both palettes, $29.99. $60 for the two of these. I didn't... I feel like I messed up the palettes. All right, guys. In here, I've, there's a combination of all the products that I purchased from Sephora in the past month, Dollar Store, Walmart, and Shoppers. Let's start with Shoppers Drug Mart. I purchased the Dior Fresh Hydration Sorbet Cream. So I started to try a new, I've actually started to try this out for the past two weeks. It's been pretty hydrating. So it comes in this really cute, it's like glass, half plastic. And it's a super light sort of sorbet cream formula. It smells really light on the face. It's very refreshing and extremely hydrating. So I definitely, so far so good. I like it. What else did I get from Shoppers? Ah, another Dior product. I got the Dior Skin Forever Under Eye Concealer. So this little bad boy. I got in shade 31. It's called Sable Sand. I've been using this product as well. I just put it back in the container to show you guys. And I still have that on my wrist. <laughs> okay. This is going to be a long goodie haul. I have so many goodies. So many. Um, okay, what else? That's it from Shoppers. Let's do Walmart. So guys, um, Love Beauty and Planet. I ended up picking these up for $2 a packet. They are uh, Blooming Strength and Shine. It's a two-minute magic mask. Seriously, we need to try these. And for the price, I'm in love. <laughs> Probably just made the focus go all out of whack. That's all good. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, what else? That was Walmart. Oh, guys, this Nivea hand cream smooth care. It's shea butter. It came in a package of two for like six dollars. Seriously, amazing. I keep one in my car. So that's also from Walmart. Let me get the dollar store over with real quick. So I know these are trending now, all of these little hair pins. So I went and picked up a bunch of them from the dollar store. And if I do a cute little do, I will share that with you guys. <laughs> okay, pretty sure I'm done the dollar store. Ooh, a good one from Winners. I got this Huda Beauty lip gloss. Can you guys believe it? I got this for, it's a lip strobe from Huda Beauty. It's like a nice gold tone. I'm really excited. I want to purchase the Trophy Wife um, Rihanna highlighter and do this lippy with that. That would be super nice. Let's get into my Sephora beauty haul. I'm super excited for everything that I purchased this month. I had to re-up on my foundations, guys. So I purchased the Fenty by Rihanna and the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. Those two have, for the past year, have been, well, since the Fenty launched last year, and then uh, the Giorgio Armani all of last year, have been my go-to. So the Luminous Silk Foundation, um, this one here, it's honestly one of my favorites just because it leaves the skin feeling not too dry. It's like a very moisturizing uh, foundation, but at the same time, it gives you that dewy glow, so I like it. And it's just super, super lightweight. And it is shade 8. So that's the Giorgio. And then for Fenty, I'm shade 300. This is the Pro Filter. It's soft matte, long wear foundation. This one goes on a lot more full coverage. Yeah, as I said, shade 300. But probably won't be able to see that. So yeah, those guys, they are musts for foundation. See guys, this haul is like super amazing. I had to re-up on my beauty blender. So got myself a new one. I'm going to actually open this soon. I had to re-up on my Fenty Glow. 
I had to react on my Fenty Glow Gloss Balm. I'm always getting myself involved in these tongue twisters, but hey, nobody's perfect. <laughs> this is my favorite. Oh my gosh, I love this gloss. So, haven't even used it yet, but I need to re up because, like I said, Sephora was having 15% off. Can you blame me? I can't blame myself. <laughs> Oh, I'm super excited for this. So I got the Tarte High Performance Naturals Clay Play Volume 2 Eye and Cheek Palette. I like this because it's kind of like if I'm going out somewhere and I know I'm going to be, you know, there a few days or overnight, this is an all-in-one. So I don't really have to carry around with me so many extra products. Um, it's really nice, actually, all of these shades. So it's the Clay Play Volume 2 Eye and Cheek Palette. I hope you guys can see that. I'm in love with all of these. I've used this already. Um, it has the bronzer, the blush, the highlighter, the bronzer's terracotta, desert blush, timber highlighter. Yeah, I'm in love with all three eyeshadow palettes. So this is going to be a key product for this summer. I should get that back in there. So like three major eyeshadow palettes this summer, plus the one in the Tribe Beauty Box I'll be using. Ah, guys, I have yet to try. Well, I've tried it now, and I love it. It's the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector. It's the pressed powder, and this is the color Champagne Pop. I'm loving it on the skin for a highlighter. I can open this up. But the girls at Sephora told me that it is, because it's like a very loose pressed powder, if you drop this, it will shatter and just turn into crumbles of powder. <laughs> but it's super pretty. It has more of like a champagne rose gold um, effect to it. So I'm really excited for that one as well. I don't want to use it as an eyeshadow. And lastly, at Sephora, Tatcha. I've got some Tatcha products. Um, I bought their Luminous Dewy Skin Mask. I'm super excited to try this one. So I will be doing this very shortly and I can do a review for you guys on the actual mask itself and then this Tatcha bestseller set. So in this set it comes with the cleansing oil. It's the Pure One Step Camellia Cleansing Oil. It comes with their polished classic rice enzyme powder. I'm super excited for the Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. I have not tried it yet. And then it comes with their um, a small size of their water cream moisturizer. So I'm really excited for this set. I'll open it up for you guys. So it just comes all boxed. And it has like a step-by-step -step direction for use. So you can get use out of all four products um, in, one, in one go. And look how cute. I love packaging that just looks so pretty. So yeah, this is amazing. And I'm so excited to try these Tatcha products, um, especially the Dewy Skin Mask. So I'll let you guys know how that goes. Okay guys, that was my beauty haul for the month of April. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I spent a lot of money this month. Oh, <laughs> heard the pocketbook, but I got some really dope products for really amazing prices. I will let you guys know some reviews. Comment below on what you want to know more about. Um, let me know what kind of content you guys want to see more of so I can give that to you. And yeah, I hope you guys love this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. That's important. Um, yeah, thank you guys. Have a great, 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 great month of May because I will be doing a recap haul of everything at the end of the month too. So peace.